not only Mrs. Marion Bush just so they can buy their house back. I mean, how? I don't understand. Well, nor do I. Maybe they're uh, going to sell the wedding rights to one of them society magazines. I don't know. You consider the possibility she doesn't deserve you. Well, I thought it was over, didn't I? I even went to Venice to prove it to myself. I just kept seeing it all through her eyes and wanting to share it with her. And there I was in the city of love, and I felt like the loneliest person on the planet. And what did she say when you asked her to run away with you? She didn't get a chance to throw me out before she could speak. Did she try to stop them? N no. Well, there you are, then. That's your answer. I think it's time you let her go, Paddy. Get on with the rest of your life. Zoe. What did you think about me and Mandy as a couple? Uh, I thought you were lovely together, always laughing, having fun. <laughs> yeah, but honestly, I mean, what did you really think? Did do you think we could have made each other happy? I don't know. How could I? Do you think we had a long-term future? Honestly? She's a lovely girl, Paddy. But? I just don't think she's the one for you. Why not? You're so different. How? <sighs> Your interests. Really? And her family. You don't just get Mandy. They all come as a package. Yeah, but I, I was going to take her away from all that, though, and... and... Give her a new family to care about. Paddy. Well, fate's made the decision for you. In an hour, it'll be out of your hands. Zoe! Something dreadful's about to happen, and I don't know what to... You're here. He went you back to the weekend. I couldn't stay away. Then it's not too late. Uh, what? Mandy's marriage to Butch is today. Yeah, I know. Well, is that it? Is, is that all you can say? There's nothing I can do about it. You can go and stop it. You have to, Paddy. You must stop the wedding. I just can't believe that she went through with it. I kept thinking that any minute now she's going to put a stop to this madness. And I thought if she'd seen me there, she would have come to her senses. Paddy, why didn't you stop it? I don't know. I meant to. And then, when the moment arrived, I was just like... Just words wouldn't come out. I know this is very hard for you right now, but... one day you might just see this as a lucky escape. That's what my mum said. You'll find someone else, Paddy, someone who's right for you. I bet you would be laughing about this on your wedding day. <sighs> Marriage? After what I've seen today, I don't think so. If I learnt anything out of it, it's that you can't really ever know anybody. Oh, Paddy. Nah. Well, it's for the best, really. I'm, I'm sort of glad that it happened. At least now I know what she's really like, eh? Close shave, though, Zoe. Could have been me marrying her. 